So to use Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, all I do is plug into the USB cable that's up front, and then I pop my phone into this handy holder here. Now, I'm using the factory Audi cable, and the reason I'm doing that is that it provides a great connection. Now, if you try to use one of those Amazon cables that you get for cheap, um, they're cheap, but there's a, you know, they also work poorly. You won't get a good connection, and you'll constantly have CarPlay or Android Auto coming in and out, and it'll be really frustrating. So make sure that you get the Audi cable that we provide um, as an option at delivery, or maybe use a factory cable like an Apple Lightning cable, just not an aftermarket cable. Now, if you're not already familiar with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, it's a really neat system. What it's gonna do is give you access to your cell phone applications right from your Audi MMI system. So take a look here. I've got my phone, uh, my music, my MP3s that are on my phone, uh, the built-in Apple Maps in this case, uh, access to my text messaging. Now this is a really great feature because you can use Siri in this case to do voice dictation. She'll read my messages to me, ask me if I want to respond, and then I can voice dictate messages back to people so I can keep my eyes on the road. Um, some other features here, go back to the Audi MMI system, listen to podcasts, uh, audiobooks, Amazon Music, that's a favorite of mine, uh, Audible, if you want to listen to books uh, via streaming, Google Maps, and Waze in this case. I know a lot of people like to use Waze for their navigation system, uh, and then Pandora. So all your different audio streaming and different navigation systems as well as phone and text messaging. So really handy to have, suggest you get the Audi Q5 that has it.